guys and welcome back to my channel so in this video I'm actually kind of excited because it's a little bit different so if you guys didn't see my like chill talk video where I'm actually just putting these twists in I will put that video right here so that you guys can check it out because I know they look nice and stretched and elongated and they look good but you need to know all of the steps that it took to get there so I'm gonna go ahead and put that here so you guys check it out because you guys said you like cards so there's that I have been rocking these twist for about a week already and I'm about to take them out actually in this video but I wanted to basically show you guys some hairstyles that you guys can do with your twist but I'm also going to be putting a twist on the video because I am also partnering with Zlul for this video and they are a glasses company now I know you guys have not seen glasses from me in a while but let me just tell you guys this brand here has the best quality glasses and sunglasses like a, a really good one-stop shop I'm kind of excited to show y'all because I've been wearing these glasses I've had these glasses since November and I've been wearing them you guys have been commenting on these glasses so I am super excited so for each hairstyle I'm gonna have a pair of glasses to go with it so let's get started with this video my first style is just the simple style that I'm rocking right now and it it's just a one-sided type of ordeal you guys if you haven't seen like my box braids or my knotless braids and all that good stuff I always flip my hair to one side that's just how I like it I love the look it gives and with my twist I like the same look so I do this every single time I do my hair you guys are probably like yeah we know all you have to do is do the twist so if you do your twist in this style where it goes to the side basically i i manipulated my twist to do that if you don't your hair is gonna look a little weird because you know as you can see the twist don't want to go there now what you could just do is put it on like this put like a spray down and really wrap it tight and then you can mold it to do whatever you want because they're just twists and they should be able to mold like that or you can just twist them to the side if you like to wear your hair like this anyway and like I said I'll have that video for you guys to check out because I did move everything to the side and I only wanted like a little hair going this way so the only thing that I would say to do to this hairstyle is to make sure your edges and stuff are sleek I like to use lovely bees now I'm obsessed with this edge control it's about the only edge control that I've been using recently and you know take your little edge brush and just go over your edges I like to do one little swoop because it shouldn't be too much hair on this side since you do have most of it going this way. So just make sure you smooth this out. And if you don't want that like gunky look, which no one likes the gunky look like that right there, just make sure you tie it down so that the scarf can take away additional excessive like product. I also like to go in with a bobby pin because as you can see some of these are trying to go the other way. So I will also take a bobby pin and just like go up in here like that. So that part isn't like continuing. As you can see, it looks a lot more polished and this one ain't sticking out or anything. So just put bobby pins. If you see some of the twists and stuff just don't wanna go the right way, just add a bobby pin, friend, it ain't that deep. So yeah, this is the first style. And I paired this up with Zlul's like crystal glasses. Well, they're pink. They're called their pink cat eye glasses and I think they're super duper cute. Y'all know I'm going to say super cute in this video like a million times but these some cute ass glasses because I picked them out okay. I picked them out. But you can put sunglasses frames in any of these glasses. You can customize anything. That's what I really like about this site. You really can customize like the shade even though they're glasses. It could have been a color shade cute okay for hairstyle number two I like to put twist in the front of my hair and the good thing about twists is that you can twist them if you especially if you do like mini twists so what I like to do part straight down the middle and then what you want to do is you want to just tie this side up so that you only have this side now mind y'all I don't have a mirror right now I'm just using the viewfinder but I'm gonna try to make this as cute as possible and what I'm doing is just a twist just a twist like I'm just twisting and grabbing hair twist grab hair and this is basically a flat twist but it's so much easier when you have other twists in your hair so just twist and make sure you're grabbing hair from both sides <laughs> once you have that twist already done go ahead and 
you know, secure it, and then put a bobby pin. You can position it wherever you want it to go. So that side is secure, and it just kind of like flows. You see that? I like how that just flows. Of course, you want to bobby pin that a little better than that, friend, but we know what we doing. We yang, yang, yang. So then you want to do the same exact thing to the other side. This is what it looks like when it's done. Two twists in the front. It just looks very nice, clean, like, it looks like I got dreads or something, man. It looks really nice, natural, and clean. I love it. And the glasses that I decided to pair with these are the Ellen Cat Eye Gold Glasses from Zilul. And these are one of my favorites. Like, I love how it's clear down here with the gold frames. And look at that gold. Oh, on the side. I just love this. Look like I'm about to be somebody's nurse. Let me check your pulse. You still alive, sis? <laughs> to see this beauty. Hello. Like, I'm here. This cat eye is just everything. It's, it's really complimenting my bra game. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? So this next hairstyle I'm about to do is super easy, okay? They all pretty easy, basically. <laughs> but this one... Y'all already know because y'all already do it with your natural curly hair, friends. So, there's that. But we want this one to look nice and fun and flirty. So, here we go. Okay, so for this next hairstyle, I'm going to be using some snappies, which is like swirly curlies. Actually, I love these things now. I know I just did a video, but I wasn't using them. But I figured out how to use them, and they sent me a care package. So, shout out to them. And they also gave me a coupon code below. So, 15% off for you guys for these bad boys. But anyway, I'm going to be doing a high bun, a uh, twist bun or whatever you want to call it so what you got to do pull all of your hair to the front all of your hair up well to the top whatever however you want it to be as tight as you need it to be okay it should get pretty tight because these are twists on blown out hair by the way so I'm gonna go ahead and add the snappy to like I like to put it in in my pinky and then just twist it around your hair as many times as you need then you just want to go ahead and snap it at the end like that snappy connected ponytail and tight well it's not actually tight on my head but it's like secure so that's what's up so then I just like to take the whole pony and then just twist it twist it, twist it until we got some stuff like this <laughs> And you want it to be kind of messy, okay? Don't make it super... I mean, you can. You can do whatever you want to do, but I'm making it messy, okay? So then I take the tail and I bobby pin it. Just that tail part, right? And then you want to play with it to see what pops out. But if, if you don't want it to be messy, all you have to do is take these small pieces and bobby pin them. I also have snappy headbands actually so I'm gonna go ahead and put this on. Just snap them together just like this and you want to push it back just a little bit like this. Still pin it up wherever you need to. Put hair out if you need to. Just make it look nice and effortless. Just a nice high bun. Fleek out your edges if you want to. I'm not going to because I don't need to. Or you could just take one of your twists out. Have a nice little bang situation going on here. That's what I'll do. Give me nice 90s. I don't care about my hair, but my hair still cute, messy look type of look. You know what I'm saying? Cute, cute, cute. And I'm going to pair this hairstyle with these black cat eye glasses. And these are the Carol Cat Eye Black Glasses. This is what it looks like. Matching my headband, you know what I'm saying? Like, what? You got the gold trim at the top. It has a nice pattern on these glasses as well. And these glasses are prescription, by the way. I don't feel like anything's gonna happen to these. They feel really, really high quality. Really, really, really high quality, okay? So yeah. Loving these. The snappy headband and the snappy, y'all. A1, okay? Make sure you check that description bar below for that as well. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. Now, the next one 
is actually two buns and you guys basically know how to do two buns but I'm gonna show you guys how to do it I'm gonna do it with my snappies again cuz it's just a lot easier to use these than to use anything else now all right so go down the middle section off one side go ahead and twist that up you're just gonna go ahead and create two ponytails all right, so now that you have your two ponytails and you looking straight childish, which the whole hairstyle is childish either way, but it's gonna give you the 80s, 90s vibe, or 90s vibes that you're looking for, okay? So anyway, you wanna basically do the same thing you did to the other one. You know, you could do this. I don't like my buns to be like, my two buns to be like super tight. So I literally just twist the bottom, the bottom like that. And then just wrap that around and then secure it with a bobby pin. And then I like to actually secure my bun down to my hair because I don't like my two buns to like be sticking out or anything. And then any hair out of place, you just want to make sure you wrap it in there and tuck it or bobby pin it or leave them hanging if that's, that's what you feel in for the moment. So you just want to do the same thing to the other side and I got bangs y'all so I got smaller twists too so sometimes you have to do it a little tighter this is what they look like I can't get it straight but you know you can put your pieces out in front if you like a little bang or something I would say do too hopefully yours want to go the right way <laughs> and if it do then add it too like that okay okay and the glasses that i'm using now are my crystal these are gifford aviators anyway i love the look of the top i don't know i like how they are normal glasses and then boop boop you know it's just like super cute super cute don't worry about this twist it ain't doing right so you can put this away and just keep one out on one side because that's cute too but for the sake of this, I really like the two. <laughs> Cause it has two buns. Like two, two buns. You, you get it, you get it. This is this hairstyle, which I think is super duper cute. But yeah, these glasses are nice quality as well. Like I know they look plastic, which they are, but like the quality of them though, it's like nice, like nice quality. It's not really flimsy. They have some weight on them basically. They have good weight on them. The final style for today is to take your twist out and to just rock your twist out. So let's get it right into this because this is going to take the longest. But it shouldn't take too long because they're only twist. And here is the twist out you guys. All of my twists are out. Now I haven't fluffed it, separated it or anything. All I've done was take the actual twist out and they're so small so you automatically get so much volume and if you guys see this straight parts here it's because I retwisted this side about three times so don't worry about that so yeah take out your twist for the last few days and I have the last pair of normal glasses that I have here they are also clear and actually these are the Gifford aviator crystal glasses the other glasses were the Felicia cat eye glasses but anyway I'll have all of them linked below but yeah y'all so I just decided to put some clear glasses with this one and the biggest ones with the biggest hair because I'm looking good try not to stare bars <laughs> so yeah last day twist out glasses check but I also have some sunglasses from Z Lil as well that I wanted to show I have four pair of sunglasses this pair I wore to Miami and the Bahamas you guys really like these glasses they are super duper cute as you can see they have nice detail on them really nice these are my favorites these are absolutely my favorites the tint on them are perfect. You can get any color tint. Like I say, you can change out the lenses. You can get them medicated. These are medicated. All that. Love, love, love. I love z -Lo. Like, I'm telling y'all, I love it. So the next pair I got of these, I think I'm into these small, sleek 
sexy glasses like my eyes are already big so sometimes I don't want those big glasses on but I really like this it's like a whole vibe like these are photo shoot ready sunglasses and I'm here for it and the next pair that I got are just like some yellow tinted ones I decided to go ahead and get like a tinted lens living for these like this this kind of rocks like these are nice 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 like you can literally make these compliment your your style your own personal style friend love it love it i had to get a big pair just to show you guys what they look like and big <laughs> but it. i i feel like a hoe brand new bitch but bitch i'm beach vibes like i'm ready for vacation you can't talk to me you can't sit with me who are you vibes okay so you guys this was actually a very fun video to film it actually took a lot of work so hopefully you guys enjoyed this video if you like this video please give it a thumbs up like comment subscribe all that good stuff because this did take a lot of work i am tired i'm hot and hungry and i'll see you guys in the next video bye Mwah.